All right, we're the lucky ones, yeah, to go out there and represent this club for the first 40 minutes. All right, this is the start of the season. Together. I think pre-season's been one of the most enjoyable ones, one of the toughest, I think, you know, for us. After the season we had last year, we did quite a thorough review of everything. And the beauty of that, it just contributed a lot to the plan of the things we wanted to change, to alter, to improve. Um, and the coaches have put a lot more time into, into using every minute we can for coaching, whether it's the team sessions, but small groups, individuals to really bridge that gap and bring as many players forward as we can because as we found last year, when you have injuries, you need the, guy, the next guys to step up. I've enjoyed the input of all the new players. Um, they brought energy, excitement. I think everyone actually has because of what happened last year. Everyone wants to make a difference. And, you know, if I judge what we've done, um, you know, we're in a good place. 32 days. Only 32 days to bath, all right? Full house, Friday night, uh, kick off our season. And it's only 11 days before we play the game in uh, France. So great weather this week, you know, perfect. The big man put on the great weather because we're gonna be playing in hot conditions, all right? So these 30 degrees coming 34, schedule doesn't change. We get out there, we get our business done. If you grab someone else to nominate, own your space. I'm one, I'm two. That is your space. Everyone works around you. As soon as you get that set in place, everything else is so seamless. I think the first block was always around you know, getting getting back into our Bears way and so forth. But the second block is about the games are coming up. That's what brought real excitement. Because at the end of the day, it's the means to the end. The, what, what do they love doing? They love playing rugby. And what do they want to do? They want to be in the team to play Bath. They want to be selected. Uh, yeah, we'll sort of the <laughs> I guess I'll get away.
Yeah, go having a good game, don't get crazy. Oh, look at it, nice. Possibly you can do that. Oh, 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 Good to get out there. I mean, we uh, obviously we brought a younger squad. We had four of our under 18s that was successful, and I thought they all acquitted themselves really well. Uh, Sam Wesley, Ed Harvey, Aaron Toll, Joe Jenkins. It was great to see them out there. They were nervous, and the boys looked after them. The thing I was pleased about is that most of uh, the guys who trained all for the preseason have got, got a chance to have a head out in the Bears jersey. And you know, it's three tries each. Um, we scored three excellent tries off, off, off the training park. Unfortunately, we lost three lineouts, missed a couple of tackles for their tries. So, um, a lot of character when we went down 19 0. Boys to come back 19 17. And, uh, um, but there's, you know, like anything, things to work with. Right. Uh, yes, You need a match one? Okay, what's your argument? That's all. We've got the straight. I think we might be beaten today. <laughs> Are we? <laughs> Minji, stop yeah. roaming! It's embarrassing! It was a really good trip because it rewarded all the guys who did the first block and a lot of young players and a lot of our successful uh, under-18s came through and our academy guys. I'm really excited by 
the talent that's coming through. You know, there's nothing like touring. There's nothing like getting overseas. And we had a great day, um, not only in the game, but the next day uh, went out to a lake. Uh, boys, again, just build those relationships, the bonds, because you know the, it helps cohesion. It helps effectively when we get on the field here. So uh, that was a really good trip for us, and um, and a great chance to get uh, our first hit out. I know it's coming. That preparation then to go into games where we have a chance to show what you can do and I think that's where the competition really steps up and that's where the energy really comes alive because guys get to do what they love doing. One non-negotiable today's energy, yeah? Energy on the ball, energy off the ball. Five weeks of hell, boys, this is what we live for, yeah? These games are what we play for. Energy is a non-negotiable today. Great game, I mean, we're under a lot of pressure. The boys stayed pretty composed, there's some good aspects, but I think the best thing is that we've got a lot of things that we can build on for the next game. We put about our pyramids physically, eh? We're all about our physicality. The rest is gravy then. We go out there, let's have a good time, eh? But we got a front. When I talked about how our learnings from last season, you know, where we we we, we played in-house games, we didn't really play pre-season. Uh, it was a shorter pre-season. That was a big area we wanted to change. So we put a lot of time into getting these games locked and loaded, and to have brief away in France, uh, Dragons away at Newport, and then Scarlets, three tough games, and they were all three of them. Um, you know, we we performed better and better, and that's given us a great launch into this season. Now it doesn't guarantee us that we're going to get the win on Friday but it goes a long way uh, to help us be prepared and uh, it's been an excellent pre-season um, but now it's now this is where it counts. This is where it counts and uh, this Friday and and, uh, and looking forward to the season. One, two, three.